Hello, today I'm going to be showing you this cool magic trick, and it's magic time. Oh, yeah. No, it's not. Magic time. Yeah, it is. Oh, well, it's not. Um, so here's this really cool magic trick I got from Julian Mather 1, I think. That was him. So, in this... Whoopsie, sorry. So... Um, so it's like, you make a clock, I'll make sure it's a big one, to fit cards all around. I have to put cards on top, so, there's a clock, and then you write magic time. Clock, you put a dot in the middle, erase the lines. Alright, so, when you have it like this, I got Monte Carlo poker playing cards. Got some of these cards. So, here's what you're going to do. I'm just going to take, like, 20, I don't know, something to the rest of the side. Now, behind, you go on top. One, two. So, actually, so you get a ten diamond or whatever. I forgot what it's called. Put that to the side. Go one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So when you put twelve cards down, whoopsies, you grab a, right? You grab a ten diamond and then put it there. So it's that's the thirteenth card, and then you put it on top of your. Well, first, let me show you how you mark it. So, when you got the card like this, you mark, it's hard to see, but you put scribble in the corner, one corner, and then erase it so that it's, you, it's hard to see, but there's like scratch marks on it, on the edge, there's scratch marks on it, there's scratch marks so the person can't see it that well. So now you want to have a sharp pencil when you do this. And then when you do, when you have that, you put it on top of the third, the twelfth stack. So it makes thirteen. No, sorry, put it right here. So it makes thirteen. So you put all. So then you stick this on top of all the others. This is guaranteed to work. And you can get these cards at CVS. That's what we got it at. So wait one second. I'm gonna do something. So, here's a magic time paper. Magic time paper. So, I am going to take a random amount of cards. I'm just going to put some down. So, I put eight down, by the way, and then... Grab this. No, you grab this, the pack that the guy did, put them to this side, and they won't tell you. So then you grab one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and then you have the stack right here. Put it all the way to the side. You won't need these cards anymore. Just put them right there. Here are the cards that the, I chose, and here are the 12 cards. So then you'll put them down around the clock like this. So let me move it. And it's hard to see, but now then you grab a pencil. I got this one at H-E-B. You stick it right there, and then you start shaking it a little bit, and then move to the number. So you move to the card that has the little scratch marks. It's hard to see, but this is the card that has the scratch marks, and it's on number 8. Oopsies. It's on number 8 right there. Now you start shaking. 
and then you move the line all the way there, and then you're like, so this is the card, is this the card you chose? They should say yes, if it's not, then you either did it wrong or they're lying, like my little brother lies when I do magic tricks to him. He just tries outsmarting me. Then you grab the rest, and then put them in another pile to the side because you're going to put them back in your stack of cards. So, another pile to the side. About right there. So then, now first, you flip over the card. It's ten of diamonds. And then they're like, all right, so what's the big deal? And then you're like, this. You will choose ten of diamonds. So that's my magic trick by um, Julian Mater 1, I think. Yeah, Julian Mater 1. Awesome magician. You gotta check out his channel. It's Nico. Subscribe, comment, rate. It's Nico. Peace out.